There are three main types of rock forming the cliffs. Sandstone, flagstone, and shale. Vast colonies of birds nestle along the cliff edge. It is possible that there could be nearly 20 different species of birds occupying their own territories. A third of the way down the cliff face is the most densely populated area. There can be as many as 50,000 birds competing for nesting spots and food in any one season. The cliffs derive their name from the Irish word moher, which means a ruined fort. The fort in question was built in Hag's Head, near the site of the oh, Napoleonic Signal Tower, Where? which you see there today. They're on... Please it's nowhere near that green thing, but... Steps, where? Well, tell me where. You can learn more about the cliffs in the Atlantic Tell me where. Oh, oh. the visitor center building. It's on one of those ledges. The talking telescopes on the other viewing platforms provide additional information. <laughs> Thank you for visiting the Cliffs of Moher today. All the way over on the other rock? The big rock. No, that's all right, buddy. Go, go, go. It's along that edge. Right? See where the standing up rock is? Yep. And then there's like an edge. Yep. Going away. It's on a, one of those little ledges. There's three of them. We'll see them later.